Hey guys, Triggermeister here, and uh, today we're starting on a new project, which is we're going to lighten the load a little bit on my hunting rifle. This is the AR-15 and 7.62x39, and uh, I did a couple of modifications to it from the original version, of course. I added a high-rise, I added a scope. Originally it had the uh, standard carry handle on it, and uh, a couple of things that we're going to do is we're going to remove the sling. Uh, don't need that. It's got a, a single point sling attachment over here. We're going to remove the standard A-frame sight and we're going to replace it with a uh, low pro gas block and uh, that'll lose some weight. And then we're going to replace the standard forearm with a free float forearm out of aluminum. Lose the high rise and uh, since the front sight's going to be gone we can reduce this height a little bit and replace it with some uh, medium mount scope rings. So uh, stay tuned. And we're back. So here is a view of all the parts that I pulled off of the AR and 762 by 39 So you can see one pound four ounces. Of course we put some replacement parts on there and that's what we're going to show you next. And uh, This is the final wrap up. Uh, as you can see we lightened this AR in 7.62x39 to 7 pounds 13.9 ounces. So previously it was 8, point, or 8 pounds 9 ounces and uh, therefore we reduced the load by approximately 11 ounces which is uh, pretty significantly when you, you know, when you're carrying the rifle around all day out in the field. So, and just a reminder, this is my hunting rifle for white-tailed deer. Just to recap what we did, we removed the A front side post here and uh, replaced it with a Troy Low Pro Gas Block. We replaced the forearm with a free float and uh, then we took the high rise off, replaced it with millet uh, high mount scope rings and we also removed the, the swivel for the sling back here. And uh, in case you're wondering how to do that, it's re real easy. You just get go to your hardware store get a uh, quarter 20 screw. I chose uh, the Phillips pan head screw and uh, get the matching nut and uh, you just basically utilize a screwdriver to kind of guide it in there and tighten it up and uh, that's the easy way to replace the screw. Hope this gave you some ideas on uh, how to modify your AR, make it lighter and uh, dress it up. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel.